politics, entertainment stories, current affairs, and exclusive interviews. Welcome. 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 On The Buzz UG with, with Melanz Mino, a.k.a. Fula. Well, many thanks for joining in on The Buzz UG. Uh, my name is Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fula. But before I take you any further, let's first have a look at the top stories making headlines today. Now, I have an update from uh, Nobat Mao's camp, the president of uh, DP, Democratic Party, and also the Minister of Justice and Constitutional Affairs. I have an update from his camp. I also have an update from uh, Stanley Chisambira's camp, the driver attached to the judiciary who was uh, recently arrested by Uganda police i have an update from uh, his camp and uh, you don't want to miss on that story as well well i also have an update from uh, the entertainment industry and this time around i'm talking about fefe busi yes i have a story from uh, fefe busi's camp and uh, i also have another story coming in from uh, rema namakula's camp interesting story i have from uh, rema namakula's camp all those are big stories that you don't want to miss on right on this platform the buzz ug thank you so much for keeping it right here for subscribing and also tapping on the bell for all the notifications i told you we are the home of all the current affairs and also the entertainment stories happening in the country what you have to do make sure that you subscribe in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications now, starting from uh, Nobat Mao's camp, uh, recently, uh, actually yesterday, uh, the Minister of Justice and uh, Constitutional Affairs uh, called upon the lawyers of uh, BBS TV and uh, CBS Radio to get ready to face off with his lawyers because he's planning to take legal action against BBS TV and uh, CBS Radio. Uh, Nobat Mao says that uh, these two stations have defamed him for a long time. For example, recently, uh, uh, BBS TV reported that uh, uh, he was planning to refer some of uh, the party members. I'm talking about DP. Yes, that he was uh, planning to refer some of uh, the party members who criticized him to the disciplinary committee. But uh, the intention is to fire them or to expel them from uh, the party. But Nobat Mao says, all that is crap. All those are lies. He hasn't said anything of the kind. So he said that uh, he's planning to file a legal complaint uh, to the Uganda Media Castle so that he can get a solution to some of these problems he also thinks that uh, some of his enemies are using these two stations you know to weaken him as a person and they want uh, the public to see him as incapable of uh, leading the party anymore yes yeah, so that is uh, the minister of justice and constitutional affairs Nobat Mao well I also told you that I have a story from uh, Stanley Chisambira's camp the driver uh, attached to the judiciary who was uh, recently arrested by Uganda police after recording an audio that went viral on a different social media platforms. Now, uh, the Kampala Metropolitan Deputy Spokesperson of uh, Police, that is uh, Luke Owesijire, has revealed that uh, Stanley Chisampira is uh, going to be released any time from now because all they wanted was, uh, you know, to record a statement at police, but any time uh, they are going to be uh, releasing him from uh, their custody. But, uh, you know, uh, Chisampira has been trending so big time on Twitter. Uh, many you Ugandans calling for his release. Uh, many seem to suggest that he has no offense he committed because he was telling exactly what is happening on ground. Uh, he said that he's paid only 200,000 and that is the truth. So there was no need of arresting him. And others are saying that it was better than keeping quiet. Uh, maybe if he had kept quiet, things would happen uh, in some different way. You know, maybe he was going to do whatever he said in the audio. So it is good that he came out and uh, talked to whatever that he said. Uh, so that a solution can actually be found. Yes, so that is uh, the latest updates coming in from uh, Stanley uh, Chisambira's camp right there. Now, I also told you that I have a story from uh, Fefe Busi's camp. And uh, recently, Fefe Busi was in an exclusive interview on a local TV station right here in Kampala. And he was questioned about his love life. Yes, uh, he said that uh, currently he's not in any relationship. Yes, he's not seeing anyone at the moment. He's actually seeing his music. Yes, that is a Fefe Busi right there. But he was also questioned about fathering Karo Kasita's baby boy. And he said that, hey, uh, he's not the right person to talk about Karo Kasita's boy. But uh, Karo Kasita, at the right time, will come out and reveal the father of uh, her baby boy. Yes, so uh, that is a Fefe Busi right there for you. That is the latest update from a Fefe Busi's camp.
Now, finally, for now, uh, the update coming in from uh, Raymond Namakula's camp. Actually, uh, before I take you right there, uh, a few weeks ago, uh, Tycoon uh, Godfrey Chirumira was in an interview and uh, he revealed that uh, Raymond Namakula is uh, pregnant. Uh, that is something that we are about to confirm. Uh, we don't know if it is true that uh, Rema Namakula is carrying another baby for Dr. Hamza. But another another information he actually revealed, he said that uh, very soon uh, Rema Namakula and uh, Dr. Hamza Sebunya are going to have a very amazing wedding anytime soon. Yes, now uh, Dr. Hamza was in an interview and uh, he said that it's very true. Uh, they are planning a mega wedding and it is happening as soon as possible and he said that it's going to be unique. Yes, yeah, so there you go. Uh, get ready for uh, Rema Namakula's wedding and uh, Dr. Hamza that is coming up very, very soon. Yes, yeah, so Rema fans and uh, the fans of uh, this couple, uh, get ready to party, get ready to eat, get ready to have a good time because uh, the wedding is coming up very, very soon. My name is Melads Milo, a.k.a. Fula. Those are some of uh, the biggest stories uh, making headlines on the buzz today. Uh, I'm still gathering more stories for you. Uh, you don't have to worry about anything because I'm here and I'll be giving you everything that is happening in the country. Make sure that you subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. It's a bye for now. Thank you.